we're going to the children's hospital to get an X x-ray and we're going to get my cast on and figure out if I have to get surgery or not. Orthopedics room. This is where he had his arm reduced when he was three, one of these rooms. So this is looking all too familiar. Good choice, bud. There's heart stickers on, guys. See them? They're in there. He's gonna have his IV over here. It's ready to go. Guys, welcome back to the vlog. So it is Monday. What's today's date? March 24th or something? Something like that. Anyway, this guy is not at school today. Obviously. Obviously. Right, and we're gonna try and go see a doctor who can look at this arm and tell us what we need to do next, right? We're both very, what, anxious? Ready? We wanna get it taken care of, don't we? So we can get it off earlier. <laughs> yeah, oh, you're a cutie pie. He's such a good patient, guys. Thumbs up for bravery. Thumbs up for being the most amazing patient. Look at this, he's doing great. Such a great boy. We're going to the children's hospital to get an x-ray and we're gonna get my cast on and figure out if I have to get surgery or not. How are you feeling right now? I'm feeling fine. My f Good. It's just like my fingers that are numb. Like my arm, where the break is, it's not as painful. And we're going to Children's Hospital Boston. Yes. Because uh, Mommy zipped right into the pediatrician, and somehow they said, if you can make it there by 10.30, yeah. and it's 9.45. We're going to make it there by 10.32. Right? We're going to get there at 10.32, and we have a half hour grace period. So yeah. we got this, buddy. Right? Yeah. We're going to get you fixed up. Boy, better. <laughs> But if I get surgery, I'll heal way quicker. Well, we don't know, buddy, right? We just don't know if they want to cast it. And I won't have to go through, like, all of the... Like, it'll be quicker. Yeah. Did you want to tell them which bones are broken? My... Your forearm, right? Yeah. Both bones. I was about to say femur, but... <laughs> no, that's in your life. So they're called your radius? Yeah. And your ulna. I broke my radius. Yeah. And your ulna. I don't have a radio. I, I don't have a radar anymore. Oh no. <laughs> and how is it? How is it broken? It snapped. Both of them are completely snapped in half. Not both of them. It's yep. just snapped in half. Yeah, both bones. What? Yeah. No, the one. Both radius. I have two bones down there. Yeah. I have two radius. No, one radius and one ulna, and they're both down here. Oh. I yeah. thought you meant the bone like that connects my shoulder. Can they see you? Can you see yourself? <laughs> Are you watching what you're doing? No. Oh man. Alright. I thought you meant like a... What's it called? It's like the shoulder bone that was broken. And I'm like, no, I can't no, read that. There? What would happen if you broke that and yours? When you have a giant cast? Yeah, it would be bad news there. It would be worse. Yeah, and you'd have to... Like, you wouldn't be able to move your arm at all. Alright, kid, let's do this. Okay. Didn't we? Mommy drove oh, pretty great. Drove that thing. Zipped into Boston. That what? Thing was also in, uh, what? This thing? This thing? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're funny. It's a nice big room, right? Waiting for our dock. You want to jump up on the table or no? You nervous? Excited? A little bit. A little bit of both. Because I feel like I want to get my cast on, but I have to take the x ray and I have to take this off. I know. So that's going to be hard to move around. And... Yeah, a little bit sore too, right? But you know what I told you? Well, All the people who do x rays here are they, really good at they, it. They're careful. That's right. Physician's assistant just came in and talked to us, and what did she tell us? That they can't take it off. Because we would lose the reduction. Yeah. They can't take it off fully. 
yeah, so we, they might want to x-ray his fingers because of the numbness. And then she's looking at the pictures, and I guess there's a little bit of angulation that's okay, so they have to decide what they're going to do with this whole situation. But I bet they're going to take this off and just put the normal cast over this stuff, because I have that on the cast anyways. I don't know, buddy. We might have to wait a while, let it heal a little bit more, come back. No idea. So that's where we're at. So we're waiting. It was planned for Wednesday, wasn't it? For someone called Dr. Yen to take a look at it. So we just want the best arm ever, right? See what he says. Fingers crossed, right? Everything is crossed. We just met with Dr. Yen and the PA. We had a very long talk. And there were three options. One was to cast it right now and mold it. Um, and manipulate the bones back together so there's no bend in the bone because there's a pretty um, pretty big bend in, in the bones so um, he could do it like that and that would be very fun for Owen. The other option is to go back down to the emergency room and ketamine again and have it reduced again and just reduced better so there's less of an angle and so that it could heal, heal properly with less um, you know less of an angle problem. The third option is to go in there and put rods in both bones wow. and pins and then in 12 weeks he would have to have another surgery to get those out and he'd go completely under with anesthesia. And so the doctor said if it was his kid he would go to the um, back to the ER. So we're going to go back to the ER and try this ketamine thing. So wish us luck, it's going to be a very eventful day here at Children's. We're going to be brave though, brave and strong. I'm going to go home as good as new. And then you can go back up and make musical stairs! They're amazing! <laughs> so we are now back in the emergency room where they sent us. We're gonna leave here in a cast and we're gonna do this all over again. We're gonna have his arm reduced. Again! Here we go again. Reduction number two about to take place. Oh. Orthopedics room. This is where he had his arm reduced when he was three, one of these rooms. So this is looking all too familiar. So this big room is where it's all going to go down. We got x ray machines, we got lights. It's going to have some ketamine again. It's going to change the channel. He's watching TV and he's going to pick some cast colors. So look at, he's got reds and blues. Look, they have light blue and, and dark blue. I might just oh, get green, it. pink! Look at all these colors. I might get regular blue. Like this one? Yeah. Let me see. Like this? Yeah, I'll get that color. Let me see it. Yeah, I'll get that. Good choice, bud. Why didn't you want to get surgery? Because we have to come back again and do the same thing, but take it out. Well, we have two surgeries, right? And that would be pretty terrible. So we're gonna do. Why? The less invasive way to get it back to normal so it can heal right on, right? And are you going to be playing baseball this spring? How long is it going to take to heal? Did you hear what he said? He said three months. Three months. Yep. At least 12 weeks. So summer ball is a possibility. Spring ball is out. Stinky pants. Okay. Poor kid's starving, but we're not going to talk about it. He's going to get popsicles and crackers and whatever he wants when it's done. I don't know what the are. I'll help you. Check out this room, guys. This is where he had his reduction when he was three, too. He's watching TV. He's got his colors there. It's amazing. Pretty great. How are you feeling? <laughs> He's good. His heart stickers on, guys. See them? They're in there. He's going to have his IV over here. It's ready to go. All right, I'm going to do that soon. And then this is all of the stuff for his cast. Look at this. All ready to go. It's the color blue he picked out. Nothing but goodness. How are you feeling? Good? How's the pain in the arm? I haven't asked you that in a while. Good? Goodbye, crazy splint. 
is absolutely the correct. Allow me to demonstrate. Your heart in there? I will take you here and enjoy the most cookie. for the IV probably next. The doctors were just in, told us what they're gonna do, what medicines he's getting. He's got probably a little bit of nerve damage on these few fingers, one and two maybe, right? And they said hopefully, most likely, it's just come right back when everything starts to heal up, right? But look, they took that thing off. My fingers yeah. are moving much better. Oh, well, that's good. We my actually but my peeked in there. But my thumb is more hard to use because it was closed in for a long time. Yeah. The back, so I'm not used to moving it up and down. You ready to get out of here? Me too. So when I'm done, I'll probably have like some water and get something to eat. Yeah, popsicles. Such a good boy. Before I got light blue. And then you I did? Got, I remember orange and red. Yeah, I got red one time. I think we had blue too. And then I got light blue. Then I got orange. But well, we have all your casts upstairs in your bedroom, so yeah. now we're gonna have some more to add to your collection. I think you have the most casts out of any boy in Foxborough. television because he's coming back to life. Are you still seeing duplicate? No. That's good. Your speech was very slow and slurry. You were talking like that. It's freaky. Your eyes even look better. You're not itching your nose anymore like a maniac. Want me to help you? I can help. Can you do it? You gonna do YouTube or TV? YouTube. Or TV. Does that hurt or anything over here? I smell strawberry. Oh, there you go. Strawberries. Chewable softeners. Looks awesome. Sugar. Kids. He's been awake for about a half an hour, guys. Oh, I haven't. I think so. Yeah, we just had x-rays done again. It's five. He said his cast, when he was waking up, he was like, he was seeing duplicates of everything. Right? Yes, I was see. Seeing doubles. Cast looks amazing. He had a really itchy nose when he woke up too. He was like attack of the killer nose. Looks so good, and I love your cast. X ray looks great. How you feeling mm -hmm. on the on the pain? Okay, no, three. A three? That's really good. We have to sleep with it re up really high. Even they said like this tonight, so there's no swelling. We want, really want to keep those bones in line. Larry's speech was really, really crazy, especially when you were first waking up. I think you're really getting back to normal now. I want to show everybody your x-ray. So this is, that's the break right there, and that's how they got it back together. He's getting some Advil because he says his arm is really sore. I know, it's coming. It's coming. He's on some Oxy, some really good drugs, perking up and even has a popsicle. So we are busting out of here in his little wheelchair. How you feel? That's good. And the pain is not a... Not amazing, but fine. Not amazing, but fine. Is the pain still a seven or has it gotten better already? What is it now? Down to like a four. Nice! I keep walking down because I don't want it to drip on Yeah, I don't want it to drip on there either. You look good. How's that sling compared to the other one? Much better. Good. The other one was a little short. Yeah. So when I got up, it would like, my arm would slip off. Yeah, it was like falling out of it. Yeah. 
going home. He wants seat warmers. He's cold. He's coming too. He's been chatterboxing to me now. He's talking to me again. Hey, so I just, we just came out. We've been in there for eight hours and 30 minutes. It was a long day. And I did not like it. Didn't need a thing. Well. Did not like it? I liked a little bit of it, like a few things, like they gave me stuff and it was really nice. But I want to talk about when I woke up. That was that was the craziest part. Do you remember? Yes. Tell them. I woke up and then I just laid down for a while. Yep. And I had my IV in. Like so, he came in. And he took the IV out and then put a little uh, bandage thing over it. And then he, I oh no, I woke up with my cast on. That's Make sure the most, you can see yourself in the camera. That's the most important part. I woke up with my cast on. If you wonder, my cast is blue. Hooray! I'm not even pointing to that. I don't know where it is. Yeah, there it is. So I wanted a blue cast. I was gonna get light blue. And then you and the doctors told me the light blue gets dirty after a while. So I'm like, oh no, I want dark blue then. And because this blue looks nicer than light blue. So they put the cast on, but before that they, I was just watching a Paddington 2 and just, just laying down. They said we had to wait and a long time. Yeah, they said two hours, I think. And then they came in at four, and we're like, okay, we're ready now. Yep, and they started setting up, and then at 4.20, I was in the waiting room having my, um, going to get my salad because yeah. they were working on you, and I gave you your big fat kisses on your forehead. Yes, that was annoying. Sorry, because I love you. And then, so like, like five minutes later, for me, at least, like I wake up and I'm like, oh, I got my cast now. But whenever I wake up from that stuff, you see like duplicates and it's like you get dizzy. Like you can't move your head a lot. Like, and you, you were know. itching your nose like a maniac. Yeah. You're going like this. Yeah, my, my nose is super stuffed up. <laughs> <laughs> they were wondering, they're like, does he have a cold or is he just doing that? I'm like, that's new. He's just doing that right now. And then when I got my x-ray. Oh yeah, then they wheeled us. Well, did you remember me being there when you woke up? And you were like, it's nice. It's very yes. nice. That was because I liked the cast. I know, you're so cute. He was all slurred speech. He was very yeah, adorable. Was, I was speaking slowly because I couldn't like. I know. What is that being? And then we had to get wheeled. Can you yes. see yourself in the camera? I had to get wheeled to the x-ray room. And they took a bunch of x-rays. Yes. They got like a up view, a side view. Yeah. Yeah, all the views. And they did your hands. Yeah, they did the hand this time. Because we were worried about the hand being broken. Hand being numb is a little weird, yeah. Yeah. But you did fabulous. So I checked that. My hand was just being numb for no reason. And we broke out of there pretty fast. Yeah. Got some Oxycontin and some Advil. We went in a wheelchair. <laughs> for the pain. Yes. Yes. And then I had a pop school. Then the car came and then we're like, oh. show everybody this? And then we were, oh yeah, I can't pick it up. All oh, right. So I got this though. Do, 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 like this. They were so they, nice. They were so nice and and they said, oh, do you want a prize for handling that so well? Okay, and I'm like, yeah, sure. Is it right? Sure. And then, and then uh, they said, uh, do you like Legos? And I'm like, yeah, why? And then they, and then like five minutes later, they come in with that Lego set. I'm like, yay. Yeah, you got to choose. Yeah, and because they like dinosaurs, it's one of my favorite animals. But they're extinct. You going to school tomorrow? Maybe. I don't think so, bud. 
I want to. Though. After that manipulation that you just had done, I think one more day home and then maybe you can go on Wednesday. Okay. Right? See how you do. Okay, that's it. But also... Is it recording? Yes. <laughs> yes, yes. Why wouldn't it be? It's been recording for five minutes. Um. So, we came here. Like, the most annoying part was because I was watching TV and then they came in and stopped it. I couldn't watch the whole Paddington movie. I wanted to watch it. I never got to finish it, so I was like halfway to the end and I never got to watch it. We can watch it at home. Yeah. It's not out on Netflix, though. So. And what would you rate your doctors on a scale of 1 to 10? 10. They were very nice. They were amazing. Super nice. How about the nurses? Still nice. 10, right? All the way around. And like, uh, what's his name? Dr. The Peter? No, the person we were talking to. Jake, the nurse? No, when we were in the room and we were talking about, oh, look, it's Oh, great. yeah, you didn't even talk about that. Dr. Yen. Yes, Dr. Yen. He was very nice. He wasn't like, oh, you got to get it this right now. Like, he, he gave us choices. He gave, gave us three choices. Surgery, and then he just, like, move my, move my arm manually or go to back to the ER again. We chose go back to the ER again and get my cast on. Because if I did surgery, we would have to go again and again. But remember, there's a slim chance that what? I'll have to. Still might need it. So ev yes. everyone has to hope and pray and put comments down below. Yes. That they're praying that we Owen does not Because I need, don't want surgery. Yeah, no surgery. It's because it's terrible. And because I... And I want to play baseball too, but I can't do that. I can only play summer baseball. Yeah. So thumbs up for this vid and this brave boy. And don't forget to subscribe and like the video and put on the notification bell or whatever. Share it with all your friends. Yes. Maybe ask them if they ever broke any bones. It's my third break. On the same body part. Mm. Different arm. Yeah, different arm. Like, it's the same body part. It's still my arm. Okay, um, this is gonna be hard to do. Okay, I'll take it. Home again, home again. Jiggity jig. Oh, tulips! Pretty tulips! Huh. You guys say hi to your broski? He had a very, very, very long, crazy day. I heard, I heard you got a Lego set. He sure did. Oh, was that in the car? I have to go get it. I was gonna build it though. Yeah, I'm not. You gonna do it? You another IV? Yep. He's probably gonna he did. do it when he gets his cast off. How are you guys doing? Good. Are these new? No, the donuts. They're the same ones, buddy. Oh, are these new? Oh yeah, open pack. They're new packages. Yeah, so they'll be yummy. These are not. Yeah, because they're not open yet. No, they're not.